yeah, then we just have one more question in the chat. I'll, I'll read it out loud for everyone that's just listening in. Um, does the feature store also store updated results of other ML models or just plain features from the DWH? Great question. So when we first started, it was just plain features because that was, you know, our phase one. We just wanted to get things, get the ball rolling. Uh, now it does have updated results of other ML models. Um, and that's really useful because as we know, the inputs of some models are the outputs of other models. And so that all of our use cases really function. And the way this really works is um, we have, and this gets into more of the feedback pipeline side of things, but we have feedback pipelines that are set up to um, output results of, of models into other spaces within our data warehouse or you know, spit out things into our log stream that we can then put directly into our data warehouse and then it gets read into our MLP to store. Um, so different ways of making that happen. And the reason for both of these thing, things is sometimes we need real-time feedback and sometimes we're okay with slower moving feedback where the actual true results or true values of inferences of ML models, we end up getting that those true values same days later. Like does a user convert? Well, we might end up finding that answer say 30 days later, but is a user a spam user? Oh, we can actually find that out like super fast. Um, so based off of when we can find out the true values of things, that's when the values are updated and made available within our ML feature store. 